So the wait is finally over since the announcement, fans has been eagerly waiting to see who will be joining the cast of The Real Housewives of Cape Town. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for tuning into the channel. And if you are new here, definitely welcome. Please do the right thing by clicking on that red subscription button down below. It's absolutely free. Fans of the franchise cannot wait to watch the show on Zanzi Magic which is said to be premiering on the 10th of July with the ladies who promise to deliver an addictive and unmissable experience. So one of the ladies is Tato Monze. She is an entrepreneur, strategist, designer, thinker and wine connoisseur. Her love of wine led her to create her own brand. Tato Wines, which has just recently been picked up by the spa franchise allegedly. Tato's aim is to reposition wine as something to be appreciated and enjoyed by everyone, not just old white men. She is on a mission to simplify the complicated world of wine and uses her knowledge host a lifestyle series called Wine with Tato. She describes herself as controversial, authentic, unfiltered, unapologetic, fun, and explosive, according to this article. Then another lady is Beverly Staney. She is a property mogul, a go-getter, born and bred in KwaZulu Natal. Beverly is an entrepreneur, a businesswoman who moved to Cape Town five years ago, allegedly. She describes herself as highly disciplined, passionate, and creative. A property owner and investor with interest in commercial, warehouse, and residential property, she loves planes, yachts, fan fancy cars, and luxury lifestyle. Designer labels are her weakness, and she collects diamonds, which are also her birthstone. Beverly believes that anything is possible in life and refuses to stand back for anyone. Then we have Rashida Musaje, a qualified personal trainer and online coach. She is the mother of three boys. She is focused, passionate and incredibly ambitious, always comfortable standing on her own. She doesn't need acceptance or validation from anyone as she follows her heart. Rashtash, Musaje, fondly known as Rashtash, Rashtash has an impressive social media presence and fitness empire. She has a global following of more than 70,000 and almost 3 million impressions per week on Instagram alone. Rashta may be tiny and reserved and always selective about who she allows to get close, but she can pack a punch. In her own words, allegedly, I'm not one for drama, but I'll always stand up for what is right. Then we also have Lifeline, aka Miss Leo. She is a blogger and mom influencer who is also a successful entrepreneur. She owns a she owns events company called La Prive and events. Miss Leo is also a proud wife of 14 years and a mother to three girls and one boy. She has achieved a lot in her custom service career. She has worked as a recruitment consultant, personal assistant, social media manager, and is also working on expanding her experience and qualifications. She is originally from Northwest and an advocate for sisterhood. Then we have Camilla McDowell. This flower fanatic and adequate expect is highly adapt adaptable and at home everywhere. From the high luxury, high ending designer stores to hidden gem local thrift shops, Camilla stands that there is more to Oakland than just the price tag. She is a humat humanitarian creative vintage car collector, a beekeeper, entrepreneur, and public speaker. Camilla is family focused and has earned her seat on the throne as the Queen of Costasia, making an unforgettable entrance at every social gathering she attends with her roaring vintage Rolls Royce moon shadow, opulent and luxury seep through her veins and she has nothing to prove to anyone. Then we have Kutazwa who is Roxy. Roxy is a lover of beautiful things, especially interior decor. Through her company Style Boutique Essay, she sells the latest trends in fashion for both men and women. 
Born in Kweheba and now a Cape Townian, she describes herself as a go-getter and a hustler. When she gets her mind to something, she is sure to achieve that goal. Roski is at home in the kitchen and loves baking and trying out new recipes. She would love to have her own cookbook one day. A few words that Roski would choose to describe herself are aesthetic, adventurous, loyal, respectful, and selfless as well as family-oriented. When we move on to another cast member is Lulando Lu Tukwayo. The glamorous and stylish Lulando is originally from Kailicha and she is a property entrepreneur, digital creator and mom of three. She is a qualified chartered accountant. She has a passion for working with community-based organizations that address issues of GBV and is the founder of an NGO called Wings to Learn. Fun, free-spirited and fierce independent. She says, I speak my mind and I can, I can be misunderstood but I've learned to embrace it. That's it, guys, about the cast of the Real Housewives of Cape Town, according to this article. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do give it a big thumbs up. And also, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, why not subscribe so that you don't miss any of these uploads. And of course, guys, we are waiting for the, uh, for, for the 10th of July to see the premiere of the Real Housewives of Cape Town. And I'll be also reviewing each episode. So tune in, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss any of those uploads. It's from me right now guys. Bye. See you on my next upload.